I looked at the mirror and I could see her staring right back at me. I almost couldn't recognize her. She's a bit pale and you can see the bags comfortably settled under her eyes. The sparkle in her eyes that could put off a volcano was gone. She smiled at me, traces of pain hidden perfectly behind her smile. Her jovial spirit that left stardust wherever she passes by is ripped apart, left with mixed emotions and feelings. The girl I knew is gone. I remember when she smiles and her eyes glitter as though she holds the galaxy shining brighter than the stars as they envied her, even when she's not a star. All I could say to her is, I am sorry. I am sorry you had to go through it alone. I am sorry the god was let down and you became the victim. You had to beat up yourself with thoughts, thoughts that haunted you every single day the moment your eyes opened to the broad daylight and wallow into the pool of tears every night as the stars twinkle in the sky. You had to bottle it up even when it hurts that it breaks you and shatters you from inside. I am sorry you had to hide and look as though everything is rosy. You. You, you had to look like a colorful butterfly that dances to the tune of the wind from one flower to the next, even when you feel like a caterpillar under transition. The pain strikes you like thunder on a rough rainy day, and lightning flashes a pitiful smile on your face. Thunder screaming excruciatingly inside of you, and agony creeping in. Yet, when gaze is casted upon you, you have your signature smile plastered on your face. Then a lone tear slides down her warm cheeks, falling like a diamond. How sad it is wanting to put all the pain away. Yet, your heart and your face sing in different tunes. She says to me, Don't be sad. I've come out strong and I'm still standing. It's a gratified melancholy.